हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वंस अगेन वेलकम टू बोलानाथ एकेडमी इन दिस वीडियो स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव द मोलार कंडक्टिविटी ऑफ 0.0 पॉइंट जीरो या मोलार एसिटिक एसिड एट ट्वेंटी फाइव डिग्री सेल्सियस इज 16.5 पर ओम सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर पर मोल या टू कैलकुलेट द डिग्री ऑफ डिसोशिएशन ऑफ जीरो पॉइंट जीरो वन मोलार सोल्यूशन एंड डिसोशिएशन कॉन्स्टेंट If molar conductivity of acetic acid at zero concentration is 390.7 per ohm centimeter per mole. Okay, students. Now once again, students, what is given that we have to write first the molar conductivity. This is the molar conductivity, students, that we are showing with. This is the symbol of molar conductivity. Here it is, students. Concentration is given. Acetic acid concentration that we are representing with C. It is given 0.1 molar. Now molar conductivity at this concentration it is given. 16.5 ohm inverse centimeters mole inverse. So, students, we will write first here when the concentration is 0.01 at the time molar conductivity is given 16.5 per ohm centimeter square per mole. Okay, students. So, this is given, students. Now we have to calculate the degree of dissociation. Degree of dissociation we are showing with alpha, students. In 0.01 solution. What will be the degree of dissociation? What will be the degree of dissociation? Calculate. We have to calculate the its degree of dissociation in zero point one molar solution, and you have to calculate the students dissociation constant. You have to calculate K A value also. If molar now condition is given students molar conductivity again that we are showing with symbol lambda of acetic acid at zero concentration. That means molar conductivity at zero concentration. It is given. 390.7 per ohm centimeter square per mole. Okay, students. Now you are, you should, students we we know the relation. Since we know the relation, students, if you know the formula, if you know the relation between these three quantities, alpha, that is degree of dissociation, is nothing but it is the ratio. It is the ratio of. It is the ratio of the molar conductivity at concentration 0.01. And molar conductivity at zero concentration. Understanding, students? You have to just put the value, students. Here it is given to you. Molar conductivity at this much molar. It is given 16.5, and molar conductivity at zero concentration. It is given, students, 390.7. Okay, students. When you divide, students, you will get the degree of dissociation. Alpha, that is degree of dissociation, is nothing but 16.6 upon 390.7. Okay, students. In examination, students, you have to do with the with the with the help of the log table. With the help of the log table, students, you have to find the degree of dissociation. So you have to take the log on both the sides. So it will when you if you take the log on both the side, students, both the side. So it will becomes log of alpha. Now, students, this is nothing but log of sixteen point six upon three ninety point seven. Okay, students, when you it is the division, students. So when you take the log, this is now log of 16.6 minus log of 390.7. Okay, students. So this is the value, students. Now, when you take the log of 16.6, students. Now, before decimal, students, you have two digit, students. What will be the characteristics? So two digit my mi minus one, that is one. Now, students, in log book, students, in 16, in six column, students, it is coming two two zero one. Okay, students. Now, what will be the characteristics, students? Before decimal, you have three digit one two three. Three minus one will be two. Will be the characteristics now, students. In log table, students, you will see in thirty nine in zero column, and when you add the mean difference of in seventh, you will get five nine one nine. Okay, students. When you subtract, students, what will come, students? Here, students, one minus nine is not possible, so you have to take the one from here. It will become ten. Ten minus eleven minus nine will be two. Now here, nine minus one will be eight. Here, students, one minus not not possible. We have eleven minus nine again two. Now here it is one. So if you bring one, it will become eleven minus five. That is six. Now two. It is already in negative students. So you can write two bar. Okay students. So this is the value of log alpha. Right students. This is the value of log alpha. Log alpha. Now you got students two bar point six two eight two. Okay students. We have to find alpha. So what happens students? This log will come on this side. Will becomes anti log. You have to take the anti log of two bar point six two eight two. Okay, students. When you take the anti-log, students, you have to take the anti-log of 0.6282. Anti-log of two bar will be 10 is to minus two, students. Now, when you see anti-log table, students, 628, and add the mean difference, students, you will get 
four, eight. Okay, students. Now, students, when the characteristic will be zero, when the decimal will be here, one minus one will be zero. Okay, students. Multiply by ten is two minus two. Okay, students. This is nothing but you have to divide with hundred. So what happens when decimal will shift like this? Four, two, four, eight. Okay, students. Here it will be zero. So this will be students. Now here it is eight. So what will be value students? Zero point zero four two. You can increase. It will becomes five. So this way students we have got the degree of dissociation. Once you got the degree of dissociation students, this is the first answer students. Dissociation constant that we are showing with K A. Okay students, K A is nothing but this is nothing but alpha square into C upon one minus alpha. Okay students. Now once you got the degree of dissociation students, that is zero point zero four two five to whole square into zero point zero one concentration is given students. 1 minus 0.0425 okay students when you subtract this quantity students how much you will get so once again students i am writing same step so this is 0.0425 to whole square into 0.01 .01. 1 minus 0.0425 students is nothing but it will come see students this way you have to subtract 1 minus 0.0425 so it will come 5 here it will be 9 minus 2 that is 7 9 minus 4 will be 5 and here it is will be what 9 so this is the answer students so you have to divide with 0.9575 okay students k a is nothing but 0 0.0425 to whole square into 0 0.01 divided by 0 0.9575 okay students how you do this students is very simple you have to take again you have to take the log on both the side with the help of the log table how you are going to students you have to take the log taking take the log on both the side both side students so this will be the log of k a which is nothing but when it will go here students it will be a 2 into log of 0 0.0425 this is multiplication students so plus log of 0 0.01 and you have to subtract log of 0 0.9575 okay students now what happens students when you take the log so 2 will be as it is students 2 will multiply now what will be the log students yet see the students before decimal you have one zero so understanding students so we are already here there is no digit but here it is one zero so students one minus one will be zero now here you have got one bar one bar minus when there will be one bar then only the zero will come here so what will be the characteristics students here the characteristics you will find minus two bar okay students here minus one minus one will be minus 2 okay students now when you see students in 24 in log table 142 in fifth column students you will find 6284 okay students plus what will be the characteristic students again here you have 10 zero, 1 minus 1 that is minus 1 minus 1 will be minus 2 so you are writing minus 2 like this and log will be 0 zero minus now what will be the characteristic students your decimal is there when the characteristics will be 1 to 1 minus 1 that is the 1 bar Okay, students. When you see in 95 in seventh and fifth mean difference, students, it will come 9811. Okay, students. So this way, you students, you have to do the, you have to take the log. Now, when you multiply, students, you will find two fours are eight, two eights are sixteen, two twos are four plus five, two six are twelve. Okay, students, one is there, two fours are minus four plus one. This will be three bar plus two bar minus one bar. 9881 okay students now when you add students it will becomes now students therefore you can say log of k a is nothing but 3 bar 0 0.2568 plus 2 bar plus minus sorry this is minus students minus 1 bar 9811 okay students now when you add students it will become 5 bar 2 when you add this to quantity it will becomes 2568 minus 1 bar 9811 okay students now what happens students when you subtract it will be 8 minus 1 will be 7 6 minus 1 5 5 minus it is not possible so 15 minus that is 7 11 minus 9 will be 2 now here it will be minus 6 minus because we have already brought 1 so this 5 bar will become 6 bar understanding students 6 bar plus 1 will be 5 bar okay students this is very important subtraction students please mind well how you are going to subtract so you have to subtract you have borrowed 1 so it will become 6 bar 6 bar plus 1 bar that is 5 bar okay students now this is the value of log of ka but we have to find ka so here it will be the anti log of 5 bar 
0.2757 okay students when you take the nt log students nt log of 0.2757 and this will become 10 is to minus 5 okay students now when you see the students in nt log table students 27 5th and 7th difference is students before that students what you will find 1887 into 10 is to minus 5 is as it is now students see the characteristics when the characteristic will be 0 students when there will be one digit when you are putting the decimal one digit one minus one will be zero so here will be the characteristic students you have to put the card then only you get the characteristic zero if a decimal will be here so this way students you have got the dissociation constant this is the dissociation constant students this way students you have to write an examination if you write this is they will ask for four more questions so this way your students you have to represent an examination if you like my video please share it subscribe it thank you thank you very much have a nice day god bless you